Conversation 1. Hey, Bobby. How are you feeling? You don't look well. I'm not feeling good. I think I am very sick. Oh, no. What's wrong? I have a headache. My throat hurts, and I feel very tired. That's not good. Did you see a doctor? Not yet, but I think I should. Yes, you should. You need to know what's wrong. Maybe the doctor can give you medicine. I think you're right, because I am getting more sick each day. That sounds bad. You need to go to a doctor. But I don't like going to the doctors. It is scary. Don't be scared. Doctors are here to help. They can tell you how to feel better. Yes, I know. I will go to a doctor because I don't like being sick. Yes, you need to take care of yourself. You're right. I'll try to see a doctor today. That's a good idea. And maybe you should go home now and get some rest. But I have so much work to do. Your health is more important than work. If you're sick, you can't work well. That's true. I just don't like missing work. Everyone gets sick sometimes. It is okay to take a break from work. Your health comes first. That is true. If you take care of yourself now, you can get back to work faster and stronger. I never thought of it that way. You're right. Just go home, get some rest, drink water, and see the doctor. It will be okay. Yes, I think I will do that. Conversation 2 Hey, Sam. There is a new fancy Italian restaurant in town. Do you want to go there for dinner tonight? That sounds fun, but that would cost lots of money. I can't afford that. Why can't you afford it? I am trying to save money. I need to pay my bills. And eating at a fancy restaurant is expensive. I didn't know that you were trying to save money. I would love to go, but right now I need to be careful with my money. So I'm going to cook dinner at home. Cooking at home is a good way to save money. What are you going to cook? I think I'll make some pasta with vegetables. It's simple and it is cheap. That sounds really good. Pasta is delicious. Yes, it is. And I have all the ingredients at home. So I don't need to spend extra money. Well, can I come over and cook dinner with you? Then we can eat it together. That sounds nice. I would love you to come. I can also bring some ice cream. We can eat that after dinner. Ice cream sounds good. Let's do that. Perfect. This sounds like a fun night. Conversation 3 Wow, it is so hot today. Yes, it's really hot. I can't believe how hot it is. Me neither. The sun is very strong. I know. I'm sweating a lot. Maybe we should go to my house. I have a pool. You have a pool. That's great. That would cool us down. Okay, let's go then. My house is not far. Great. Do I need to bring anything? Maybe bring a towel and some sunscreen. Good idea. Sunscreen is very important in this weather. Yes, 
We need to protect our skin from the sun. How big is your pool? It's not very big, but it's good for cooling off. That sounds perfect. So, do you like to swim? Yes, I love swimming, especially in hot weather. I agree. Swimming is so refreshing in hot weather. Do you swim often? Yes, I swim every weekend. It's nice to have a pool. I can imagine. I wish I had a pool. Well, you can come to my house and swim anytime. Thank you. That's very kind of you. All right. Let's go to my house and start swimming. Yes, let's go. I can't wait to jump in the pool. Great. This will be a good day. Yes, a very good day. Thank you for inviting me. Conversation 4 So, my birthday is coming up soon. I'm thinking of having a party. That's great. Parties are fun. But I don't know who to invite to the party. Well, start with your close friends, right? Sure. My close friends are you and Mike and Sarah. What about Emily? I don't know. Emily and I are not that close. She is nice, though. And she always invites us to her parties. That's true. Okay, I'll invite Emily, too. Good choice. What about your work friends? Yes, I can invite some work friends. Maybe I will invite Tony and Lisa. Sounds good. What about Jane from work? I'm not sure. Jane is always so loud. It's a bit annoying. Yeah, true. But it's a party. It will be loud anyway. Okay, fine. I'll think about Jane. How about your cousins? Like Bob and Sue? Yes, I will invite Bob. Not Sue, though. Is there a reason you don't want to invite Sue? She always argues with people. That's not what I want at my party. That's true. Good point. Should I invite my neighbors? Maybe just invite the ones you talk to often. Okay, I'll invite Mrs. Smith. I talk to her often. Are you inviting any of your old school friends? Maybe just Tim and Lily. What about Peter? No, Peter and I had a fight. We're actually not talking at the moment. Oh, okay. I understand. Better to keep the party happy. Exactly. So, is that everyone? I think that is enough people. Just make sure to not forget anyone. I will double-check my list later. Thanks for helping me. No problem. It will be a great party. I hope so. Thanks for helping me decide who to invite. You're welcome. Can't wait for the party. Conversation 5 Hey, son. Can I talk to you? Okay, Dan. What do you want to talk about? You are getting older now. You need to start thinking about getting a job. A job. But, Dad, I don't want to work yet. I understand, but you need to start paying for things yourself. Why do I need to do that? You and Mom pay for everything. Yes, but you are growing up. You need to learn about money and hard work. But I get money for my birthday and holidays. That's enough for me. That's not the same. When you work for money, you value it more. What does value mean, Dad? Value means how much something is important to you. I guess so, but work sounds boring. Work can be hard, but it is also rewarding. 
What does rewarding mean? Rewarding means it makes you feel good because you did something useful. I don't know, Dad. It still just seemed too hard for me. Listen, son. When you earn your own money, you can buy things you want. Like a new phone? Yes, like a new phone. Or games. Or clothes. That sounds nice. But I still don't want to work. It's not just about buying things. Work teaches you responsibility. What's responsibility? I don't know what that means. Responsibility means doing what you need to do, even when it's hard. I get it, but can I wait a bit longer until I get a job? I'm just not ready yet. The sooner you start, the sooner you learn these important things. Okay, Dad. I'll think about it. Good. I'm here to help you find a job when you're ready. Thanks, Dad. You're welcome. Remember, working hard helps you in life. If you want to continue learning English, click on this video here. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and practice your English in the comments below.